to Vlogmas Day 6. It's Sunday. I've been up. Hmm. This is about 10 to 4, I think. But I've been barely crying. It was he was funny. It wasn't a big it wasn't like the normal had to go out, but he was crying every so often. Eventually I thought, well, it's 10 to 4, I'll just get up. Um, but he came downstairs and just wanted a big drink of water, so I'm thinking the little bowl in the bathroom must have been empty because he just wanted to drink. And then he went outside, sat outside for a couple of, I don't know, probably two hours or so. Came back in, had another drink, then he went back out, but then he's back in again. <laughs> so, he's over there. Excuse my messy house. What a mess. That's, to me, that's messy. Ugh. Uh, yeah, I've just um, got a really sore back today, so I've just put the heat pack in to have my back. I'm not feeling amazing, but I'm going to try not to dwell on how I'm feeling at the moment. I just have to feel really good again. Uh, so, I don't know. I'm getting annoyed now. <laughs> getting really annoyed uh, with my body. Um. So I don't know what we're doing today. I'll see how I guess a bit, a bit later on. I'm sort of. I just realised we've got our fake Christmas Eve with the pals next weekend, next Saturday, and my month birthday on Friday. So we've got some presents, but I still need to buy some more presents. So I need to get shopping sometime. We did have a little look yesterday, but uh, I'm just not a good shopper anymore. I don't want to be shopping, so it's really hard for me to, <laughs> to shop. And so yesterday I bought a washing up brush. I could have easily bought, like, I saw other stuff that I could have bought and once upon a time would have bought, but now it's like, no, I don't really need that, or that's just too expensive, or I can make do without it, like, it's just, and I have no desire to go to lots and lots of shops, I just kind of think, what do I need, like, what do I really need, or where might I find something for someone, other than that, it's like, no, I don't, I'm not interested, it is the strangest thing, but I used to be, so, you know, so into shopping, so into shopping. I said to Kevin, I was chatting on the way up here today and um, saying how kind of we wish we could have learned what we know now, like 10 years ago, like we married 23 years ago, like if we met, learned these things 10 years ago. It's only been probably the last two years that I've stopped shopping and the last probably three years that we've stopped spending pretty much all our money. <laughs> so, yeah, I mean, three years is probably since we stopped spending our money and putting aside extra money which we never really did before that we just would get it we'd spend it um oh my gosh if we learned now or even 20 years ago gosh if we'd known we would be we'd have our house paid off no problem we would be having all the holidays we wanted i don't regret money spent on holidays i regret the money spent on things that i don't have anymore like <laughs> what a waste <laughs> And even though we first got married, we had takeaway an awful lot. I must have spent an awful lot of money on takeaway and stuff because it was a big adjustment for me because I just got married, I just finished uni. So I started work, got married, it was totally different. It was a big shock to my system. I didn't know how to balance it all out. So where's my other ear? I've lost my other ear, there he is. So I didn't know how to balance it all out. Anyway, <laughs> I'm gonna get my heat pack and go and sit back down. And um, yeah, well, I guess we'll just see what today brings. I really, either I have to get to the supermarket or I have to send people to the supermarket because like I have, the food situation's a bit ridiculous. Like there's food here, but I can't make many meals <laughs> like that I would eat anyway, like the plant-based, but I need potatoes, you know, need bananas, we've got, um, I don't know, I just don't seem to have, it. probably potatoes is the biggest problem. And was, oh, lettuce, we haven't got things for a salad, so. A lot of things that I have every day, we don't have the ingredients for, so definitely need to do that. So I'm just chatting while I'm getting a cup of tea ready. Um, I've just been editing well, the video from two days ago. I didn't do any yesterday. It was naughty. Sorry, guys. It was my wedding anniversary, I guess, but yeah. And because I have to do it on the main computer, that's a real pain. So um, anyway, I'm hurrying to do my tea because another live video thing I want to watch. But yeah, well, there's quite a few channels I've just started watching and doing like you, the, no not you now, they're on YouTube, the live thing on YouTube and I've actually been really enjoying them but um, the ones are starting now so we're going to go watch that. Um, yeah so um, I think I'll make another, I don't know, it's late now, it's already started. I might bring my laptop through here and watch and prepare some toast. I think I'm just going to have the same breakfast I did yesterday because I really enjoyed that. 
I've been, yeah, I think I'm a little bit of a run at that at the moment. It's so nice. Um, so yeah, I'll do that. Don't just show you, you guys in the last two days anyway. So I'll um, be back later on. Said I'm not feeling great. Kevin's not feeling great. So I don't think we're doing much. So I'll be around the house. <laughs> Okay, anyone who doesn't like spiders, look away for a minute. I'm just going to show you our little spider friend. Also, the kids have named him George, I think. <laughs> we saw him last night. He's very cute. He's just a harmless huntsman. He's not even as big as they get. Uh, I think he's living behind one of these paintings. <laughs> he's really quite cute. And even Christy, who hates insects, doesn't mind him. He's, um, yeah, so he was behind that painting. I mean, I'll freak out if he, if he dropped on me, I would freak out, but I know he's harmless. He's just going to eat spiders, and, no, he's not going to eat spiders, he's just going to eat mozzies and flies, so he's kind of cute. I have to conf I have to confess, I've done a big fat nothings today. I've just been on my computer watching that live show. It's actually still going, I've just left it. Um, <laughs> Just making some lunch. I mean, the main thing that's not me really feeling good, but I did get my video edited and uploaded. We're about to watch a movie. I'm watching Ant Man, I think. Um, and I'm just done making a salad for lunch. As you can see, some groceries we've got. And some mess was made. <laughs> I'm getting really stressed and cranky about the mess and about not feeling good for most of the day. Like, I feel a bit better now, but like, it's 1.30. I still don't feel amazing. But it's, just, it's really frustrating me now. I'm, I know I'm taking it out on my family, which isn't fair, but I'm just getting grumpy. So hopefully, hopefully tomorrow's the start of a new week, and I'm starting to, I am starting to stress about the holiday. We're doing our fake Christmas Eve and fake Christmas morning next weekend, and I am not ready for Christmas. I haven't bought a single present. I am so not ready for Christmas. I, I lie. I probably have picked up a few things for the kids, but for things, but I do not feel like it's Christmas next weekend because I know it's not really, but it's our Christmas. So I guess I'm a bit stressed about that and I just, uh, but yeah, <laughs> take a deep breath. Tomorrow's a new week and I hope I'm feeling better to tackle my new week. Here's my salad. Yum. Guess what? Finally going to go out by the pool. It's pretty late in the afternoon. Oh, Rosie, <laughs> I'm just ran into the back of a leg. Four o'clock in the afternoon, so there's not much sun, so. Um, as you can see, Kevin's got his scuba tank there because he's going to go in and try and clean the spots off the, bar, off the, off the floor. We've got quite a few um, like marks and stains. I don't ask me to look for them. I think they're quite obvious. <laughs> Maybe not. Anyway, that'll be nice and sun up for a little while. So have a little swim. I'm thinking the water. Oh it's, oh, it's actually really warm. It probably hasn't been turned down enough yet for summer. <laughs> it might be too hot. So it tends to happen early in the season. Kevin bumps the temperature up and then it's too hot to really be cooling. And then I'm going to have a little lie in the sun. So that's where I'm going to be for the next half an hour or so. Also the puppies are going to have a scavenger in the... Where they'll hunt around. way to spend an hour very very nice I'm getting inside now you can see there's some clouds coming across but the sky is pretty clear otherwise just a few starting now so okay, the, pool, the pool looks a bit cleaner Kevin's giving it a clean that was just that was just so nice so I'm gonna go oh can't see I'm going inside now and have my watermelon I cut up earlier but um I was sort of achy out there my Legs are still a bit burny and achy, but now actually lying in the sun was more relaxing than being in the pool. So I feel nice and relaxed now. <laughs> Good time to do it too, because the sun's not too strong. I didn't involve with sunscreen. I got a bit of get a bit of vitamin D, and as you guys know, I have not been out in the sun for a while. So I think it's okay. I was only half an hour, and I lay in, actually lay in the sun for about ten minutes or so, and the rest of the time I was in the pool. So, anyway, it was very nice. Kevin okay, and I having the tea from last night. What do you think? I know the smell, but I can't think of what it is. What was the one for you? It's the spider, he's walking. I was going to show you guys the spider again, he's on the move. 
was coming down my picture. He's only got seven legs though, Mr. Spidey has. At least he's not above my head anymore. It's a banana nut. Oh. You ever heard of banana nut tea? What do you think? Oh. It's very, very pale, isn't it? Mm. Very pale. That tea's actually very nice. Oh, I'm just going to get hot. I'm already warm. <laughs> Let's drink a cup of tea. So I've also put potatoes in the oven for dinner. I think there's some leftover. What did you guys have? Lasagna for lunch? Cannolis, Canna yes. Cannelloni. Cannelloni. So I had salad and they had cannelloni. But I bought and it just, I think it went off yesterday. It expired. It was used by yesterday, but it'll be alright today. So Kevin found it in the fridge. That was good that he found it. So there's a bit of that leftover for dinner and then they can have some of that and some potatoes. And I'll just have potatoes. I'm actually looking forward to it. I said to the theater, we ran out of potatoes pretty early in the week and we've had no potatoes all week. So that'll be nice. I mean, she must have just had her dinner. She just came in and did a big silly on the floor to rub her face. What are you doing now, Rose? You were a big silly. Did daddy do your dinner? I started cooking it before but Kevin's gone and cooled it off for them and given it to them. And taken the bins out because he's a good hubby. Was that a good dinner, Bailey? And they're going to wipe your whiskers. Only Rosie's going to wipe her whiskers. I've got potatoes for dinner. Yeah, you can't film. I'm recording. What are you doing? You're going to film me. Took his robe off. So he's standing naked in the kitchen. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> he's put it back on. So you couldn't film me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Alright, we're just watching it Love Actually. You can probably see behind me. So they were having tea and I was just thinking, oh I love tea. So we decided to do our Christmas Advent tea. So the banana one was really good. Did you like the banana one, Kevin? Yes. I didn't think I'd like it because I don't like banana flavoured drinks, but it was yummy. So we are day what seven? No, six. Day six, day six. It's number six. You gotta find there it. it. It's all the Glitter and gold. You gotta sniff it first. Very full. Well, we're gonna do all, all of it for all of this today. <laughs> it's so weird. How much do you think of that? I just think it. There's a weird angle going on. I know. I'm being attacked. Let me sniff it again. I don't know what it is. I'm not very oh, good at knowing. It tells you things. on the back. I think it smells okay. It'll tell you on the back. It tells you what's in it. Somewhere there. Chinese black tea, lemon peel, sugar, sprinkles. Yes. Hydrogenated canola oil. Perfect. Titanium I do, oxide. I do worry about some of the ingredients. <laughs> Cheese and flavouring and more well, sugar. I like titanium watch bands, so it might be nice. <laughs> it's just oxidised, rusty. So I just need to get rid of the tea that's in the teapot from the one earlier. Yeah, you got to do it in slow mo. No, I don't know how to do that. Okay, you're a lose. You can just go plonk. Well, it's not coming out very well. It's all <laughs> stuck. Well, as always, I really enjoyed Love Actually. It's such a good movie, and I think it's 12 years old now, and I don't think it's dated at all. Still so good, so I enjoyed that. So it's heading up to bed. I've just cleaned up the kitchen a bit, put the dishwasher on. And as always, like, this is the best I've felt all day. I've still got my burning hands and feet. And I was just saying to Kevin, I didn't have the burning feet I, and hands. I'd really be tempted to step and do something productive, like even clean or something, because I feel quite good, but it's like it's time to go to bed. And I am tired because of We've been on early mornings again, I think like 10 to 4, 10 past 4 this morning. Whereas you're having a drink behind, behind the scenes as she is. Anyway. So as Amber always say, let's hope I feel better in the morning. I'm kind of losing hope at the moment. <laughs> Still eating really well, so it's very, very frustrating because there's nothing more I can do to help me feel better. Like... Christy bought that little basket, Kevin ate all that, Kevin ate the chocolates, Nan gave us, like, I've not had nothing of that, like, I've eaten so well, I'm not being too worried, I'm not, not hard, I don't, I don't care, but I'm not worried, interested in that food, so, it's just so frustrating, I just want to feel better, anyway, <laughs> we'll see what tomorrow brings, I just hope it's better, because, yeah, 
This is getting boring very, very fast. Anyway, I hope you've all had a really good weekend and yeah, the countdown's on now. Two, I think it's two days, two weeks and four days till we go on the cruise, something like scary. <laughs> anyway, good night, I'll see you tomorrow, bye.